All right, this is an update on my non-stop running devices uh, after one year. And uh, I just wanted to do an update on this. Um, this is the one that was the most impressive right here. It's a Laser Saber Easy Spin that's running on a uh, simple two transistor dad have type design uh, transistor circuit with a little solar panel to get solar energy out of this window. And then I had to move from this uh, capacitor here, which was a 10 farad 2.7 volt, to a paired up. Uh, two 6 farad 2.7 volts uh, and the only reason was this capacitor had a failure right there at that terminal point right there the capacitor still works and I just shoved it down in there and it still um, still functions but it broke off right there so I moved to um, the paired capacitor uh, and that's just kept right on going. Now this is another one that's um, doing just fine. And then this one over here is um, just fine also. And they're running on this circuit right here. If you could take a look at that. And this is a modified dad have um, complementary transistor circuit. A couple of values are a little bit different. Um, and of course uh, I'm using capacitor instead of the battery on uh, some of these. Uh, this one here is a little a watch battery. It's a three volt watch battery, re rechargeable uh, lithium watch battery type thing, and it, it's been doing fine. Um, the other thing I wanted to show over here is the uh, the yearling motor that I was trying to get to run for a year on one double A. That did not make it. That one there several times I've had to change the battery on that. It's one uh, AAA battery and a 1.5 volt and if that drops down to um, about 1.2 volts that stops. So I've had to change the battery and the way to get around that is uh, use 3 volts and then put a, a dropping resistor on it. But uh, the yearling um, motor that I was trying to get to go for a year didn't make it. I had to change the battery twice on that one. So anyway, that's just an update on my non-stop running devices after one year. Thanks for watching.